Yu-Gi-Oh! contains trace amounts of maltodextrin. Please consult a doctor before consuming Yu-Gi-Oh! It won't be long now until the Pharaoh and my brother's dark side do battle. I only hope that Melvin hasn't found a way to regain control over his Millennium Rod. Thank you for calling the Millennium Item Tech Support Hotline. All of our agents are currently busy playing card games, so please remain on hold and we'll get to you soon enough. We assure you, your call is very important to us. No! Pass, you automated tech support hotline! You have put me on hold for the last time! You see, it's exactly this kind of bullshit that makes me want to murder everybody. Since I seem to have fully recovered from my life-threatening coma, I'm gonna challenge Kaiba to a card game. Was it playing a card game what put you in a coma in the first place? Yeah, but like my dad said right before he died of alcohol poisoning, what doesn't kill you only makes you stronger. Hey, Kaiba. My name is not Kaiba. Since we both lost in the semi-finals, we should duel to see which of us deserves to win the bronze medal. <laughs> win the bronze medal. Oh, that's cute. I like it. Oh, hilarious. You're a funny guy, Joey. Joey's right. There are no real losers in Duel Monsters. Ha, <laughs> ha. Tristan, why are you laughing? Your hair looks like a box. Look, all I want to know is whether I got what it takes to beat you after all this time. <sighs> I'd be surprised if you have what it takes to beat Mokuba. I would kick your ass, white boy. Play nice, Mokuba. <laughs> Quit disrespecting me, Kaiba. My name is not Kaiba. Duel me, or are you just a chicken? You tell me. You're the furry. My brother's gonna murder you, white boy. Down, Mokuba. Very bad. <laughs> Win the bronze medal. Classic Joey. Come on, pick up the frigging phone before I stab someone out of boredom, as opposed to the many other reasons for which I tend to stab people. This is Jerry from Millennium Tech Support. What well, seems to be the problem? It's this rod. Ever since Yugi and Kaiba dueled, it hasn't been obeying me. Okay, first off, have you tried turning it off and on again? Have I what? Have you tried turning it off? and on again. Since when did this thing have a frigging on-off switch? It's a magical artifact! Have you changed the batteries recently? Are you listening to me? This is a piece of ancient Egyptian history. It's a mystical relic handed down through the ages. Sir, sir, what? sir. What? Calm down, okay? Okay. Calm down. Okay, I'm calm. We're calm. We're calm. We're calm. We're calm. Okay, did you try turning on its Wi-Fi capability function? WHY THE FRIG WOULD IT HAVE A- It's time to duel, Kaiba. My name is not Kaiba. Oh, Joey. Kaiba is going to slaughter him. I'd be surprised if he even broke a sweat. How would playing a card game make you sweat? Clearly you have never played the Dark Magician Girl. Don't go easy on me, Kaiba. Just cause I was in a coma and probably suffered extensive brain damage, that doesn't mean I'm not gonna give it my all. Trust me, Wheeler. Even if you did have brain damage, I'm sure none of us would treat you any differently. Good. Wait, what? While these foolish fools are being distracted by this dong measuring contest, I, the evil Malik Ishtar, shall take control of their friend, Tea Gardener, and force her to do my bidding. But first, I must come up with a plausible excuse for leaving the area. Oh no! I, Tea Gardener, am having my period. I had better go insert several tampons inside my vagina, or else I might get pregnant. You do that, Tea. Nobody wants you to get pregnant. Least of all me, Tea Gardener. <laughs> Her voice gets less convincing by the day. A Shizu! Taya, what are you doing here? And why does your face seem even more vacant than usual? Sister, it is I, Merrick. I have taken control of Tea Gardener's body so that I can defeat my evil half. Putting yourself in the body of a helpless girl so that you can defeat the ultimate evil. That's pretty stupid even by your standards, Merrick. Thank you. Wait, are you wearing a bra? No, I took that thing off. It was getting in the way of my girls. Merrick, I command you to put a bra on this instant. I refuse. My melons were meant to be free. Merrick, cease this foolishness. I can jiggle if I want to. I can leave my bra behind because my boobs don't bounce and if 
They don't bounce with air, no boobs of mine. Manic, come back. I don't know why I told you any of this. Bye. Joey and Kaiba's mutual hatred of each other is making this duel hard to watch. I summon Gear Freed in attack mode, you son of a bitch. I activate enemy controller, you ass clown. Rich boy, hacker wuss. Money bags. Idiot with blonde hair. I hate you. I hate you a slightly larger amount. Just f already! Wait a minute, are you even Egyptian? No sir, I'm from New Jersey. I demand to speak to someone from Egypt. I'm sorry sir, but all our call centers are outsourced to America. Friggin' typical! No wonder he wasn't any help. Take your filthy hands off my shiny rod. Well, if it isn't Dora the Explorer. Where? I mean, no, it's me. Manic. I know. I'd recognize those boobies anywhere. Have you finally come to claim your hug? No, I've come to claim your life! You dumb motherfucker! Don't you know that even if you succeeded in killing me, you'd be losing the only chance at regaining your body? It would just be like killing yourself! Curses! Out of all the airtight plans I've created, this just had to be the one to fail! I'm going to enjoy carving you into a thousand tiny pieces! But wait, what about what you said before? It'd be like killing yourself! What can I say? I'm die curious. Just f already. I'm glad I'm not wearing a bra. They don't call me T Gardener for nothing. Wi-Fi mode on. No, my brain. Think of all the stomach-exposing tops I'll never get to wear. Leave my brother alone, brother. Is she so? I see you got your rod working again. Let me guess. Tech support? Yes, although apparently using it as a murder weapon voids the warranty. And speaking of void, prepare to be introduced to it. Give it up, Wheeler. This duel is as good as over. You're just as worthless as ever. Yeah? Well, say what you will about me, Kaiba. But at least I'm not- If you're about to make a comment about my being adopted, save it. I'd rather have no parents than live a single day in your shoes, Wheeler. You're a joke. Your father was a drunk, and your mother was smart enough to walk out on your ass when you were too young to start poisoning the world with your stupidity. But by all means, call me adopted. Go on. Do it. I was gonna call you a dork. Well, that was about as scathing as a YouTube comment. It looks like Taya's gone missing. Why do you care? She has my keys. I have to rescue them. Say hello to the Shadow Realm, Merrick. Hello, Shadow Realm. I'm not even spawned from your mind. Hey, Taya, can I have my keys back? Wait, what's going on here? Fado, you shouldn't be here. It's too dangerous. Melvin is about to destroy all of us. But are my keys okay? Your keys? Yes. I require them to open things. Welcome to the party, Yugi. We were just about to play Twister. It involves me twisting your neck until it goes snap. We were also going to play Snap. It has similar rules. I usually enjoy parties that have unconscious women on the floor, Melvin. But this party is just bad. You should really think about hiring a magician next time. Or at least a piñata. Don't worry, fellow. When we do, I'll give you more piñatas than you could possibly imagine. <laughs> I don't know how he did it, but he made that sound bloody threatening. Oh my god. God, that's right, Pharaoh. Friend me. Friend me. Friend all over my face. Oh, that's so friendly of you. Oh, you're such a good friend. Make friends with my vagina. Taya, wake up. Oh my god! I didn't say anything weird, did I? Yes. Oh, Pharaoh, you came to rescue me. Actually, I came for my keys. Oh. Wait a minute. They were in my pocket all along. Way to waste my time, Taya. Just f already. Now I bring forth my blue eyes. No way. Old blue eyes is back. Blue eyes. Wipe out Joey's remaining life points. Man, I lost again. But at least I held my own for a while, huh, Kaiba? We were still on the first turn. Oh. I hope you learned a lesson from all this, Wheeler. Never try to do anything ever. You'll only fail and look like a f***ing idiot. Big Brother, quit being so mean. What? I think Yugi was right when he said that you have nothing but hate inside your heart. You have nothing but hate inside your heart, Kaiba.
Also, you dress funny. Ah, ah, dress funny? Don't be silly, Mokuba. Hey, Kaiba's a good guy. Yeah, and even if he doesn't want to admit it, deep down he knows he's our friend. <laughs> Okay, let me make this very simple for all of you. You're losers. I don't mean that in an endearing way. It f***ing hurts me that I have to interact with all of you so much. Duke, you're a lecherous pervert with a failed game store. Congrats. Oh, uh, Wheeler. The only reason anyone even acknowledges you is because your best friend is the king of games. You'll probably end up in jail in about five years with bills coming out of your ass because you have absolutely no real life skills. And you're a giant parasite on society and everyone around you. We well, don't have to be so rude, Koiba. And my name is not Koiba. And Tristan. Tristan, you are the single most worthless human being I've ever met. Deuces. Hooray! I'm friends with Kaiba! Do you want to dance with me? Go and f*** yourself. Why won't anyone dance with me? Because I want to f*** you. I usually enjoy parties that have unconscious will And your mother was smart enough to walk out on your ass before you were too young to fuck. That's not the right line.